Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of the Crypto Entrepreneurs Podcast with your host, Charles. Enjoy. What's up, everybody? It's Charles, and this is episode one. I'm excited to have finally started this and hope that I can bring some value to even just a few of you. This first episode is going to be a little bit different from the rest. Normally, I'll have a guest on with me, but today I'm just going to give you a rundown of what this show is all about and some quick background on myself. If you're listening to this show, you've probably heard of Bitcoin either on the news or from a friend, family member, or neighbor. But what you might not know is that there are thousands of other cryptocurrencies and even more businesses being built around them. For example, we've got exchanges, wallets, news sites, ATMs, conferences, traders, the list goes on. What I do on this podcast is have different entrepreneurs on to discuss the businesses they've built and give you tips and tricks on how you can mimic their success. Most people find Bitcoin, make an investment, and then let the market dictate their financial well-being. On the Crypto Entrepreneurs Podcast, we provide you with the knowledge you need to start your own business and take control of your financial well-being. We're at the cusp of mainstream adoption, and if you don't get involved now, you're going to be left behind. Brokerage firms like Fidelity, E-Trade, and TD Ameritrade are rolling out crypto trading, and companies like Google, Oracle, and Microsoft are establishing blockchain divisions at their companies. I urge you not to let this opportunity pass you by and to get involved today. Now about me, I'm an entrepreneur at heart and I've been building businesses since middle school. After college, I took a job as an analyst to build up some starting capital and pay off those pesky student loans. Staying true to my entrepreneurial spirit, I helped entrepreneurs secure funding so they could continue to develop and grow their own businesses. After two painful years, I threw in the towel and decided I was going to work for myself. My time is now split between three successful businesses, this podcast, an Amazon business that does around 30k in revenue a month, and a contracting business. I may work longer hours than I did at the bank, and for less money, fingers crossed that that's not always the case, but it's much more rewarding, I'm glad I left, and I don't plan on ever going back to work for anyone else again in my life. Now that you've got my story and understand what this podcast is all about, I hope you stick around and find a few episodes that really resonate with you. If you vibe with a particular episode and have more questions about how to get involved, don't hesitate to reach out to myself or my guest. We're always willing to help. And lastly, this show's success and its ability to free others from the 9 to 5 is heavily dependent on you guys. If you enjoy any of the episodes, all I ask is that you leave us a review and share the show with others in your social circle. See you guys next episode.